<laughs> hey guys, I'm in Montebello, California today, my hometown, right off Whittier Boulevard, or actually right on Whittier Boulevard at the Chevrolet Montebello dealership. Standing next to me is Chris, the owner. Hey, Chris. Hey, Dan. How you doing? You may not know this, but Chris is a big angler. He loves to go fishing, takes the family fishing, does a lot of freshwater fishing with his family up in the mountains, San Bernardino Mountains. And uh, Chris, we want to talk to our viewers a little bit about it's fishing season is right yep. here. Definitely. A lot of guys have boats that watch our show and follow us on Facebook. Yep. And they've been working on their boats. We've been doing a series on Absolutely. little things to get your boat ready. We haven't talked about getting your truck ready to tow the boat. That's funny, Dan, because I just I just dropped my uh, my ski boat and my uh, pontoon boat oh. in uh, actually this week. At the lake. Uh, so it's at the lake. So I'm. I'm on board with you getting it all ready, uh, but a lot of people don't know about getting their truck ready. Mm -hmm. uh, hey Chris, so what are some of the key things that they should look for? Well Dan, number one thing is brakes. <clears throat> you want to make sure that before you take your boat, whether it's to Baja, San Diego, up to Lake Arrowhead, Lake Mead, you want to make sure you get your brakes inspected. Right. A lot of people don't know that. When you're going down that ramp or going up that windy mountain. That's a bad time to find out they're not working. Well, you're putting you're putting extra stress on your brakes. You're, you're towing, you know, 8,000, 10,000 pounds. You're putting more wear and tear on your brake pads. So you want to make sure that you get your brakes inspected. And not only the brake stand, but also your suspension. A lot of people don't know. Shocks don't last forever. Suspension, they don't last forever. Okay. So it's very important that you come to the dealership, get an inspection on this before you go out and take your boat for the season. One time, you do it in you know May mm -hmm. or April, May, and then you're done. Then you have peace of mind that you're gonna be safe traveling and towing your boat. Now, especially if you're taking your family with you. I know a lot of you take it for granted. You just have your buddies with you, towing it, going down the boat taking the boat down to the ocean or to the mountains, but especially you got your little kids with you. It's a cheap investment to bring your truck down here to the dealership in Montebello and see Chris and have it checked out. Have the tire pressure checked, have the shocks checked. And I would have never thought, check your suspension. And Dan, you know, we do a free, free multi-point vehicle inspection. So you come in, you're gonna need your oil change. You're gonna need your tires rotated. We do a free multi-point vehicle inspection. We give you that multi-vehicle inspection report. So it has three different, it has red, yellow, green. Okay, green means everything's fine. Yellow means, you know, it needs look some attention. Something. You need to look at that. Red means get it taken care of right away. Service advisor will go over that multi-point vehicle inspection with you every time you bring your vehicle in. And also, you wanna make sure that you use a quality brake pad on your vehicle. A lot of people think, they can go to a uh, aftermarket uh, brake pad. It's not going to last as long, Dan. And it's also you're going to get that squeaking. And it's I you know I tell people again and again, yeah, aftermarket brake pad. It's cheaper, but you get what you pay for, as you know, Dan. Yeah. And I can't tell you how many times over the years I've seen trucks slide into the water on the boat ramp because their brakes are no good or their oh, tires yeah. are no good. So yep. it's really important if you bring your car into a dealership, they can check for that stuff. There's nothing more embarrassing than having your vehicle just slide right into the ocean. You can't do anything about it. Well, at least you have a new Silverado so you can <laughs> tow them out, right, Dan? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I have a brand new Silverado that I bought right here at the Montebello dealership, the Chevrolet dealership right here off Chris. So it's pretty good. Chris, those are great points. And I'd just like to remind all our viewers there, if you want to get a free fishing trip with me, Right now, Chevrolet Montebello is offering a deal. You come here, you tell them you watch a TV show, you buy or lease any brand new vehicle, and they'll send you on a three quarter day fishing trip with me, be on the TV show, and we'll make sure we introduce you on TV too. But that's great, thanks for all those tips, Chris. And they're guaranteed to catch fish when they come with you, right? They Dan? should catch some fish. <laughs> we always catch fish in our trips. All right. All, right. all right, thanks folks. And where can they find you? They can find us at ChevroletMontebello.com online or they can give us a call, 323-728-9181. We're open, service is open Monday through Saturday, Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. And Saturday, for your convenience, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. So That's service cool. is only closed Sunday, sales is open. 24 seven. Yeah, <laughs> just about. Yeah. Nine, oh. nine to nine, Monday through Sunday. And we're gonna be giving you a little series of these videos to help you get ready for the fishing season. You know, I like to make sure that you catch fish and I'm giving you those tips too. But more importantly, I wanna make sure when you tow your boat, you do it safely, 
you get your family there safely, and you get them home safely. So Chris and I are going to be yep. teaming up, talking about things you need to your vehicle, kind of vehicles that you need, and a bunch of little safety tips. Your whole family should watch these so you're prepared and ready to go when you go fishing. Catching the fish is the easiest part. Yep. Getting your vehicle ready to go, getting your boat ready to go, all that stuff is the really hard part, except you have to spend some time working at it. All right, yep. well, that's today's little video blog. Don't forget to subscribe right here to my YouTube channel. And Chris and I will talk to you again really soon. Thanks for watching. Thank you.